to telecom. There's one there. Another telecom there. Another different type of telecom there. This is when I was a German champion when I beat Zabil. Another telecom there. Another telecom style there. Another telecom style there. Another telecom style there. <laughs> So I wanted to bring you along on a little visit. There's a guy in Melbourne. If you're a cyclist, there's a 99.9% .9 chance that you know who he is. His name's Lee Hollywood Turner, ex-president of the biggest cycling club here in Melbourne, heavily involved in the cycling community. He's an ambassador for Bicycle Networks. But above all else, he's a super colourful character and he loves a kit. Shorts. <laughs> yeah. I'm still, I've been so yeah. busy. I've been so busy. Seriously, I've been so busy today, mate. I'm so busy. What's going on? I haven't had a chance to get dressed because I've been so. Busy. I was. This is unbelievable. I was naked to lunchtime. We're coming in to check out your kits, and this is what you're wearing. I've been naked to lunchtime. This is how I'm busy. I'm busy, mate. Oh, That's awesome. I can't believe, oh, see, I'm not joking. I've been that really? busy. Really? Is this how you normally work? Naked or in cycling kit or boxer shorts. The office is probably, I have the office on 28 degrees. So I quickly go like this and they probably think, what's he doing? Because I'm naked. Right. Because I just, I'm always naked. Right, okay. I just like it. Yeah, right. Come upstairs. We're coming up. You're going to show me your kids? Yeah, I've got kids okay. downstairs and upstairs. Oh, really? Can you show me what's on the wall there? Like, can you show me those Yeah, vibes? I can show you. Of course, this is art. Just look at this. Beautiful. Wow. And look at that. Beautiful. Yeah. Just Why he the hidden in the tree? Why are they no, hidden in the tree? No, no, it's not actually, it's just because I love me, love my trees. <laughs> and it's just, this has just taken on a life of its own. So I've got kit all over the house. Yeah. So for argument's sake, in here, this is all the vests. Oh, right. All the vests are in here, and skin suits are in here as well. So skin suits are down the bottom there, and all the vests, there's a stack of vests. So I, how many have you got all up? About 170 kits. 170 kits. And growing. All up. I've got stuff coming from eBay. Yeah, right. Ellie's have have you opened this? Ah, uh, no, I've still got stuff over one. I've got, to, I've got to beat that out. Ellie doesn't know that. No, Ellie doesn't know that. Okay, right. <laughs> she doesn't know. <laughs> so just, just be it tight. I put on a light. Yeah, put on a light. Come in, come in, come in. So is this where all your kits are? Wow, it is no, more like here. More bikes. More bikes. Beautiful Shimano wheels. Wow. A nice selection of Shimano wheels. <laughs> Durace tub 60s, 40s, 20s, I've got everything in there. Wow. Beautiful, beautiful. So basically, I've got stuff in storage as well. So how, how, how it works is, these are all, this is basically all the, all the longs. So this is, all, this is all the longs. So these are all my longs. This is just purely longs. Right. These are from an ex-pro, Peter Silkowitz. I got them from him. He's got an eight year ban for doping. Poor bike, I'm sure he's innocent. Um, so yeah, map eyes, oh, they're the three quarters. They haven't worn them yet, they're new. So that's all That's all the- um, All the longs. That's all the longs and the jackets. The jackets are, oh fuck, I can't feel anything in. Jackets are, this is just, these are rain jackets. Rain and, rain and, and a lot of them I haven't worn yet. This is all just all rain jackets of all, every description and type. <laughs> rain jackets galore. Look at rain jackets galore. Oh, rain jacket. Do you? How often do you ride in the rain? This morning. <laughs> you had a black one going this morning as well. Yeah, the black one's a good one actually. Where's that gone now? The black. I know it's black and it's boring. And it's not me. But what I like about this one is you push that. And it, oh wow, so there's the bling. There's a bling, and that's reflective. It is such a good jacket. And all different styles of map eye. Like that's a map eye rain jacket, Wintex. This is a map eye, just a, a winter jacket. And then obviously I've got all the map eye jackets in different styles, Carrera. Look at this telecom, different styles wow. of telecom here. Look, white with pink, pink with white. I've got, I got it all, man, I've got it all. This is like an ex, this is a pro. See, so you've got the names written in on the, written in on it, so I've, I find, I've got a secret website where you can buy X-Pro stuff. So 95% of everything in here is, um, what's it called, eBay. 
Carrera rain jacket. Look at that with a clear back. Back in the old days, it was like right. a rain jacket in a clear back. I know, I've only worn it once. So <laughs> we might have to pause while I put this back. Okay. And then we'll, and then we'll, we'll go again. All right. Who's that? Patrick Silkenwitz. He rode for Quickstep, MapEye, Telecom, and a host of other teams. He's got done twice, so he's got an eight year ban. But I got all my uh, MapEye stuff off him. Just we spoke, I bought one thing off him off eBay, then we spoke offline and he said, I've got all this stuff, he sent me pictures and he said, if you send me the money, I'll send it across. And I'm like, oh, this could be a scam, but I thought, you know what, stuff it, who cares, it's a risk. So I paid him all this money and then within half an hour he sent me an email with a photo of this big box yeah. with my name on it. Yeah. Within two weeks the box turned up all the map eye stuff in it genuine wow. genuine map eye stuff he wrote in when he wrote right yeah so now we go into that the, the the heart of it so this is just basically the kits doesn't i've got other stuff in storage so don't be too disappointed but it's, it's all in here <laughs> but if we sort of just go through it a bit by bit we've sort of got oh man there's stuff everywhere coming out Tom Ficanti, Cipollini, Carrera, Carrera Switzerland, Onsay, a different type of Onsay. I'm just gonna have to do it, dump it because there's 170 of stuff, su suckers. So we do it a bit quicker. This is a classic one here. The um, Castorama, that's like the um, overalls. White jersey, I won at the Giro. Pink jersey, I won at the Giro. Yeah, I won that last year. <laughs> Aqua Supreme, Bicycle Networks, Rapper. Stitch and Dart's still one of my oh, favourite yeah. team kits of all time. Yeah? Oh, pink Who, and who's Stitch and Dart? That's a team I'm in with um, a group of just guys around Melbourne. St Kilda Cycling Club's first ever kit. Oh, yeah, wow. That's their first ever kit. Wow. And it's got a um, patch in it when we used to race at Westgate at the go kart track in Port Melbourne. We used to race there on a Wednesday night. And I crashed. <coughs> Jagged, that's good. This is an Jagged. experiment. Right. See this top? This is an experiment. This was off AliExpress for $19.99 delivered. I've never worn it, but I just wanted to see what a $19.99 .99 jersey delivered from AliExpress raffle would look like. Race Atlas, they signed me to a 10 day contract for a million dollars. This is a great kit. Yeah. You always know when a kit's good when people say it's ugly. That's a great kit. <laughs> Kunda Korda rides for the Netherlands. He gave me his world kit, which is really nice of him. He's a good dude. Tonelli, always good custom clothing from our mates at Tonelli. I rode for Spain for two years. <laughs> One of the greatest kits wow. of all time, GIS. Another great kit, which is um, Babici, very different, but they're cool, the guys from Sydney. Cath OSC12, that's a great, oh, geez, I used to love that. Another good kit. So they don't make kits like this nowadays, they're all boring, look at that. It's beautiful. This is an interesting one. This is a female women's mountain biking team. And uh, I like it, so I bought it. Girls from Argentine. See, the problem with this is this jersey is a size too big for me. So what I do is I bought it, and then I'll just wait until there's a medium available. And I'll just buy a medium and probably sell it. So why do you buy the large? Just so I can have it, just right. in case. That's a great kit. I'm trying to buy the long sleeve. Oh, this, is me. this is my homeboy in America, the Hardy. The OG from Long Beach, California, yeah, he's a good dude, he works for Zwift, so that's his kid, he's got his own foundation, so he's a great guy. Somewhere, I haven't worn this yet, this is when I was going to ride the tour down under, but the Chris Hamilton actually ended up doing it, so I didn't have to, I wasn't required. Supper Club's a gang, we don't talk about it. Stitch and Dart, this is a great jersey, this caused a lot of controversy on the internet. This is the, uh, from Babici, Catalan Catalana which I knew nothing about. I just thought it was a cool jersey, but since I've found out that they're, a, uh, they're part of Spain and they want independence, they want a free vote, and I wore it and posted it, and I got death threats and got oh, called wow. a fascist, a racist. And so that would be your most controversial? Yeah, this would be the most controversial. Yeah, so I'm okay. going to wear this in Madrid and okay. take a picture and say, come and get me. <laughs> I may not make it back. Uh, one of my favourite kits is Army Deter. I love that team. That Army kit is awesome. Camo, I haven't worn it yet, black top, but it actually looks quite smart with the camo. So that's good by Giant. Now we move, now we'll just keep moving along. Wait a sec, we've just done one shelf. Yeah, one shelf. <laughs> one shelf. <laughs> one shelf, we're still coming. So telecom, there's one there. Another telecom there. Another different type of telecom there. This is when I was a German champion when I beat Zabil. Another telecom there. Another telecom style there. 
another telecom style there. Another telecom style there. So as you can see, I've got every... Why so many telecoms? Top. It's pink and it looks good. And I, and I love yarn ori. So that's right. that. This type of map eye, which is a great kit. We've got this type of map eye. This is, a, this is one of my favorites, that one. That's a good one, that's rare. That's a good one. Then we've got when I was a world champion, when I rode for Map Eye with the matching world champion white, white bibs. So that's another one there. This is another one, look at this. Still got the tag on it, Map Eye World Cup jersey. I don't wear world champion jerseys only on Christmas day, special oh, occasion. Oh, so I wore go. that one last Christmas. I'll wear the World Cup one this Christmas. This is a classic, this is rare. Very rare. This is the Cipollini Tiger one. Aqua Sapone, proper Tiger bibs. I've got this in the skin suit as well downstairs. So that's rare. <laughs> oh, there we go. I can't skin handle it. Shimano, another skill oh. Shimano, but that one's got green in it. When I rode with Paddy Lane. Paddy oh, Lane and I rode yeah. together for the AIS. Look at that. Sunglasses are a bit of a, more helmets up, helmets up there and around the back. Sunglasses are in here. So this is just all, Sunglasses are all in here and in here. So that's all the sunglasses. Yeah, this is technically the last one. We don't have to pull it all out, but <clears throat> this is all just long sleeve winter jerseys. So as you can see, there's obviously going to be lots of map eye, telecom, Benesto, another telecom, skill, ben Benesto, telecom, telecom, Fassa, telecom, telecom. Telecom, more telecom, telecom. Most of the um, short sleeves have got a long sleeve to go with it, and I've obviously got a lot of long sleeves in storage down below. Then we've got leg warmers and that there. Uh, anything else? Shoes. Oh, shoes. We come out here. There's shoes are in here. That's shoes. Shoes are in here about 20 pairs of shoes right. so that's shoes which ones do you ride with it's clear cut the shimano fire which i love the spire fire is a fantastic shoe the mavic yellow ones are a great fitting shoe i love these yellow mavic ones these velo kicks are a really cool shoe colorful and so forth i only i hate them they're uncomfortable it's like wearing bloodstones with a piece of wood strapped to your feet but they're in pink and they look good, so I'll wear them down again when I need to match them up. But I don't, I don't like them. Most of my helmets are in storage because yeah. there's just too much room. But that's obviously when Tom won the Giro. This is a reissued, um, this is what happens every morning. A reissued Map Eye helmet, which is really cool. Yeah. The, that's a really cool helmet. Matches my camo kit. A cask pink one, for the, but it's a different shade of pink. So you think pink helmet, but they're all different. Yeah, yeah, like I put all my stuff on Instagram and I, I just do it for fun. Like, um, but yeah, so I just I just honestly play dress up with me mates. I like looking good. That's how I got my nickname 20 years ago from Brookie and Warren at Mainline Cycles because I used to always dress like, like to have everything perfect when I rode and I used to try and dress up, dress up like Jalabar because I always wore on say. And they used to go, oh man, you're just so Hollywood because I was like that. And then it just, it, it stuck with my cycling friends. They're all my sort of cycling crew called me Hollywood and, and I guess it's appropriate because it's all style no substance and that's what I am all style but no, there's nothing there oh, I no, couldn't no, no, couldn't no. win a race yeah, seriously okay. I can't get around my own ride now because I'm just so hopeless so yes yeah, so I've got a box downstairs of all caps so yeah. nearly every kid I've got the matching cap matching winter beanie win thermal hat I've got everything so yeah, okay. like I always wear map eye Doma Fakanti but you remember I ride nearly every day but I don't photograph every day yeah. You know, I'm lucky I've got a good mate, Lewis, who is patient and will take photos. And Ali, my uh, partner, she takes photos. Because you, you, I'd get sick of riding with me because you go, w where are we going to stop and take a photo? <laughs> so Lewis is good. He's my creative director. Yeah, I'll okay. say, Lewis, what's, yeah. a, what's, a, what's the scope today? And yeah. he'll say, we should go here or there's a wall there or there's that there. It's just honestly, at the end of the day, it's just fun. I don't take myself seriously. I'm not a good rider. I just love riding my bike with my mates playing dress ups and having a laugh that's yeah. all it is seriously that's there's nothing more to it it's just a bit of fun i just love the bike and uh, yeah that's it